Hey y'all, welcome to a Tennessee Thursday Thursday on Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Beer Reviews. Hey, I'm down here in Bell Buckle, Tennessee, and uh, I've got a beer for you today that was brewed in Nashville, Tennessee. And I like to, uh, when I can, I mean, I, I have limited access to a lot of brews, you know, where I'm at. But when I can, I like to get some Tennessee brews and put them on, on Thursday. What I've got today is from the Black Abbey Brewing Company down there in Nashville. It's a Tennessee IPA dry hopped India Pale Ale. All right, from the Black Abbey. It's got the cool Tennessee logo on the can. Love that. Love my home state. Born and raised Tennessee. I've lived in. I've born in Memphis. I've been to Knoxville. Lived in Knoxville, Nashville, all all different all, all over Tennessee. I'm a Tennessee boy. I bleed orange and all that kind of good stuff. Um, anyway. I sent my buddy Wayne Allen one of these, and he's already reviewed it on his uh, account. So I wanted to try it, see what it looks like here. This stuff is 5.5% alcohol by volume. Got a nice, pretty gold color, man. Dead gum. Nice head on it. Just a tad hazy. Man, it's just a gloomy day out. Oh man, it really got cloudy when I poured that bottom off in it. Oh, oh man, it's got a nice, nice hop characteristic in the in the aroma of the head there. Ooh, the Black Abbey Brewing Company out of Nashville, Tennessee. Hope y'all can see that okay. That's a pretty brew. See the haze, nice lingering head there. Beautiful. Nice hop aroma. Mmm, mmm, mmm. It's got uh, it's got a nice hop flavor in the head too. It's 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 got a mild piney hop flavor in the head. Let's see if it gives me what kind of uh, it don't just a touch hazy Tennessee original hoppy beer from here. It doesn't tell me what kind of hops it uses on the can here. Um, and I'm I'm not. Uh, I'm not skilled enough to know the flavor of different kind of hops, but it has a mild piney hop flavor to it in the head. Um, nice hoppy aroma, beautiful brew. So anyway, hey, on a Tennessee Thirsty Thursday, this uh, Black Abbey Tennessee IPA dry hopped is for all American workers. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Whatever state you live in, if it's California to Florida, uh, you know, Maine to New Mexico, wherever you are, if you work for a living, I appreciate what you do. It doesn't matter what you do. It don't matter what kind of job you have. Your job is essential and important. And I just want you to know that I appreciate the work you do to support yourselves and your families and pay your own way. I know what it's like. I do the same thing. I'm the only breadwinner in my house. Um, so I, I just want y'all to know that I appreciate y'all. This beer's for you. Cheers. Wow, that's different. <clears throat> that is different. It's smooth, and it's a little bit, it's got a kind of a strange taste to it. Um, all right, so I, I got a mild piney hop in the head, and a nice aroma, nice hop aroma coming off the, the head of it. The body itself is very smooth, but it has a, it doesn't really have a pine hop flavor to it. Um, I don't know exactly how to describe it. It's not piney, but it's almost got a, um, let's take another drink, <laughs> shall we?
the flavor of the beer is it, it's got a it's got a just a, a hint of bitterness to it, and it doesn't have it maybe just a just a little whisper of pine in the body, um, but it's something else. Um, it, it's smooth. It's not strong. Uh, Y'all, I'm just a dumb old redneck. I have a hard time describing some of these flavors I get in these beers. Um, it's good, but it's not great. Let me put it that way. Um, I probably would not buy this one again because the, the flavor is just a little bit strange. I mean, it's, it's, it's just a little bit strange. It's not undrinkable, but it's just a little bit different, and I, I can't really... I can't really put my finger on the flavor I'm getting out of it. Anyway, I've got four more of these. Is that right? Yeah, I got four more of these to enjoy, and I will enjoy them. 5.5% um, ABV. Decent brew. Not wonderful. Not great by any stretch. Uh, the one I did yesterday, that Trojanator out of Hershey, Pennsylvania, man, at 8.2% ABV, that stuff was outstanding. I loved it. It's not so great. It's okay. It's okay, but not great. Anyway, hey, that's been a Tennessee Thirsty Thursday for you this week. I'll be back tomorrow for a Friday's R for you. Um, y'all stay tuned. Take care. Love and appreciate y'all. Cheers.